Welcome back. Mosquito control is a daily operation that involves multiple moving parts, including helicopters, labs, even chickens. As many people eye a new species of mosquito discovered in South Florida, ABC Action News reporter Jada Williams is taking us inside one facility focused on being prepared if and when it lands here in Central Florida. A room full of mosquitoes, usually a bad sign, but not in this case. This is our insectary. We intentionally raise mosquitoes here uh, for a variety of different reasons. Adult mosquitoes swarm in cages. Larvae swim in water. The research at the Pasco County Mosquito Control Center keeps the rest of the county from looking like its lab. We use the adults to monitor for resistance to the products that we're using. Um, each one of these has a different species of mosquito in it, and so um, we are looking at numerous mosquito species to ensure that the products that we're using are actually going to be effective at controlling them. The research is especially important right now. South Florida is abuzz with a new species. We have very close relatives of that mosquito here in Pasco County. We have not yet identified Helix lactator. Um, however, we are constantly monitoring for invasive species. Um, and the reason for that is we're looking for potential for disease transmission. The work isn't confined to just the lab and mosquitoes aren't the only animals necessary for research. Chicken coots throughout the county control potential disease spread used to indicate where carriers may be flying. Then there's pinpointing exactly where the mosquitoes fly rampantly in the county. So with the passive traps, a, a collection of 100 or more is, is indication that we need to really hone in on that area. For one of the traps that are baited, such as this trap here, um, several thousand mosquitoes is, is really what we would be looking at. And that's when we would move forward with additional control measures. Control measures that target every inch of the county. Like this helicopter, filling up on solutions that kill larvae near hard to reach bodies of water. Its target, those tall tree lines. For the tall grass near water, trucks spray solution. And then there's this. An amphibious ATV hitting the water to spray plants known to attract mosquitoes living on its roots. We have a variety of different individuals on staff that uh, really come together to comprise a very comprehensive integrated mosquito management regime. Making sure our journey outside is as pleasant and safe as can be. In Pasco County, Jada Williams, ABC Action News.